Hey, what's going on everybody? How's everybody doing today? In today's video, we're going to be going over how to install camos on Ghost Recon Breakpoint. Well, how to install camo mods, uh, particularly the multicam faded camo mod um, on Ghost Recon Breakpoint using Anvil Toolkit. Before we get into that, a shout out to Spectre Gaming Net. Thank you so much for making these mods and all the other people on Nexus mods that have been coming out, you know, with this constant mod for Breakpoint, dude. It's super refreshing and it's brought life back into the game big time, dude. So, um... You know, I just decided to get Ghost Recon Breakpoint on PC once I seen all these mods coming out. So, I still got a lot of work to do. Like, my profile has nothing on it, dude. I have really not unlocked on anything or beaten anything on the story. Because before this, I was playing uh, Ghost Recon on PlayStation, like, forever. So, anyway, enough of that shit. Let's get into how to install the mods. So, we're going to go right here and open up Anvil Toolkit. And before we get on that, if you guys haven't used Anvil Toolkit before, you're going to have to go over here and into your settings, click on your files, make sure use compression is unchecked and compression ratio is set to zero. And once your game is linked to your Ghost Recon, Pro, uh, once Anvil Toolkit is linked to your Ghost Recon um, files right here, you're all good. You're going to want to right click that and select game. Bring this down and there is no description on how to install the mods on this particular mod but um it's pretty simple on this one we're going to use data pc resources patch 01 forge and i'll show you guys where that's at first we're going to go ahead and i'm going to download this one right here the uh, multicam faded with coyote secondary color because i already did this one to make sure it worked before i made the video for you guys so we're going to do the second one right here together show you guys how to install it so we're going to download it make sure you click slow download whatever so i don't have you know the hell of expensive version you know pay for me i can use this shit for free all right so we're going to click save and right here i'm going to save this to my camos folder all right now i'm going to open this up drag that right there for you guys so we're going to go make sure you have a zip folder a 7 zip or winrar whatever you use extract your folders once you do that here is the one that we want faded multicam with coyote and see those those are the files that we are going to put into the patch so right here we're going to go over here back to anvil toolkit now and we're going to go to data pc reforges or resources patch 01 forge right click on that and actually first before we do that, sorry guys. Before we do that, delete your if you have previous mods in there. I always delete my pre uh, previous extracted mods so that way I don't have to repack a ton of stuff. Anyway, all right, now go over here and data PC resources pack zero one forge. Unpack that, and then once you see this, you're gonna go over here, and you don't want to unpack it when you get to this. We're gonna open containing folder. And then once you have this opened, we are going to create a new folder right here. Name this extracted. Hit enter. And then once you see this, you're going to open that folder up. And here is the mods that we got. And here is our extracted folder. Make sure you are doing this correctly. Put cop or highlight all three of those and drag and drop into the extracted folder that you just created now close down the mods so all right close down the mods that we downloaded now we just got the extracted folder open we are going to refresh this and then just back out of that real quick and close that down now we are back on the um anvil toolkit we're gonna go right here hit refresh once you hit refresh, you see the extracted folder pops up in Anvil Toolkit. Now, we're going to double click on that and you see all the mods that you just put in are going to be here now. Now, we're just going to highlight one of those. Control A so we can highlight them all. Right click and repack. Once you repack them, if you did it right, it'll say finished repacking data files right up here. Successful three failed zero. That means it read your files. Now, we just back up on that okay yeah, that's good back out of that and then you will see data pc resources patch 014 right here 
make sure you do that and repack that that needs to be repacked and now you're good your files are all back into um, anvil toolkit all repacked nice and neat and we are going to go ahead and hop into ghost recon breakpoint and find the camo that we just put in to make sure it worked let's go hey guys so now we're back here in ghost recon breakpoint and um you can see I have on the faded multicam with the black secondary from the first one that I entered, but we did the one with the coyote brown for the secondary color. So what we're going to do is go over here to the camos and find the one that it replaced, which I do not have, I don't think. So we're just going to go find it to make sure. See, this right here is the multicam faded. It replaces the Atex, and I think the one that we did replaces the cat pit or cat pet. So we're going to have to go find that, and it is right here. And it did work, see? Um, we do have to buy this from a uh, shop. I don't know if I got enough money for it. So let's go ahead and open the bivouac and check it out. Let's see if I got it. Let's see if I got enough money for it. I don't think I do. But no worries if I don't. Okay, uh, where would it be? It'd be right here. Oh, yeah, I do. All right. Um. I'm wondering if it does it for the weapon. I don't know. All right. Let's, uh, let's go see before we exit. All right, so, um, we got multicam with Coyote Brown now. We're going to go ahead and put that on. And now we got multicam with Coyote Brown on the knee pad. So I kind of like it uh, with the black on the pants. Let's do the vest with the Coyote Brown. And the backpack with the Coyote Brown. Either way, you guys can mix it up with every way you want. And I think the original, that replaces the original version of Multicam has Multicam faded with khaki. Um, you know, so it depends on what your style is. But either way, now you guys know how to enter the mod yourself. Um, so you guys can go ahead and play around with that. And be sure to check out some more of SpectreNet Gaming's uh, mods. He does have ones on other, a lot of other camos. So, um... This way should work for all of them. If you guys have any problems or need help with anything else, go ahead and leave a comment in the comment section. And I'd be happy to get back to you guys to see if I could help you figure another um, modern situation out. Thank you guys for watching. Catch you on the next video.